Now from Safeco Field in Seattle, MLB The Show is on the air. James Paxton gets the starting nod for the M's. What's your take on him, H? Leading off well, man, I'm really excited to watch this guy. Pick. Oh, look at the sliding stop in time. And that's a huge play to keep the leadoff man off base. First pitch on its way. Stephen Forward is in with one away now as he swings and misses here at strike one. Harold this Indians ball club as they begin play here this afternoon four and two over their last six games including a win last time out and Matt you know you look at their split right now but they lost the first game one to second one so you're looking at momentum is on their side that's why I'm kind of leaning towards them here in the third game. This is it high in the air out toward left center falling for it Zapata. No trouble with this one and the inning is over. One two three go the Mariners. We are still scoreless. Into the windup and the pitch. Swing and a miss way behind the big fastball. You know when you're facing a top of the line pitcher like this he's going to be down around the knees like that more often than not. The key is punishing whatever mistakes he makes but so far he hasn't made many. Time for a look at the majestic defensive alignment for the Indians. And I'm looking at Will Myers playing first base. Yes, first base. Now, I know he came up as an outfielder, but, man, has he become a pretty good defender at first base. I love his actions. I love how he moves, and he's pretty graceful over there. And a fastball blew it right by him, and there are two down. Now, here's the pitch. In there, no balls and a strike. Billingsley. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. And he just misses with a curveball. Right over the middle, knee high. Still looking for our first hit in the ball game. And this is drifting foul back into the stands. That's probably not what he wants to do with two strikes right there with the fastball. A swing and a miss. That retires the side, and that will do it. Welcome back to Major League Baseball on the show from Seattle Washington all set now for the top of the so digging in now Ramon Herrera he is of course a guy to be wary of if he gets on base a stolen base total leads the ball club throws in time and that's out number one. Now to the plate George. Corona first at bat for him in this one. He was one for four with the double in the ball game last night. Oh, that's for sure going to be a pitch he wants back. You're not going to get many balls right in the wheelhouse from a top level arm like this. And this is swung on and missed his fifth strikeout already. And there are two gone in the inning. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Cesar Hernandez is in with two away now as he looks at a called strike one. Strike two. He's not messing around this inning. He's attacking the zone. He's showing lots of confidence. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will retire the side. And here's Jose Peraza. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ballgame. Chop foul over towards the coaching box. 0 and 1 count and the pitch. A wave and a miss, a tick behind a good fastball. Swing and a miss as he ran the fastball right by him for the first out. Digging in for his second at bat. Steven forward. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Hit on the ground is short. Throw to first will get him. Already two away here in the home fourth. Ready for another chance. Dan Vogelback. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Sends that one out of play for strike one. And he takes a pitch right down the middle. No runs, no hits, and no errors in the game for the Mariners to this point. And he struck him out, his eighth punch out of the ball game, and that one ends the inning. Mariners are down in order. Still down three. Leading off for the Mariners. Set Foul back. Byron. Buxton. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 and 1. Ripped on the ground to first. And he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. 
digging in to try it again. Mitch Henniger comes into this right at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Matt, I tell you what, I love how he's pitching right now. He has continued to pound that first pitch for strikes. When you do that, you set yourself up for great success. Struck him out, and he becomes the ninth strikeout victim thus far. Stepping in and ready for another shot, Johnny Billingsley. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. A fastball, and he swings through it to fall behind. And this ball's heading for the seats down the right side as the count will move to 0 and 2 now. And he will strike him out. 10 now in the ball game, and the inning is over. Into the box now, Ramon Herrera. To lead it off as we start the home sixth. Ramon Herrera. The windup and the 0 1. Takes a knee high fastball. No balls, two strikes. Now the 0 2 pitch. Fly ball out to straightaway right. Chisenhall moves over. He's got it one away. Riding in once again, George Corona. He's 0 for 1 thus far. George and he throws the fastball by him here, 0 and 1. And this ball's heading for the seats down the right side as the count will move to 0 and 2 now. And he struck him out. And there's strikeout number 11 in the ball game. So striding in, Cesar Hernandez. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. In there, and it's 0-1. And this is going to be a foul ball. No runs, no hits, and no errors in the game for the Mariners to this point. Grounded down the third baseline, but a foul ball, and the count holds at 0-2. And he struck him out. So it might be time to begin the countdown as he's now gone through six innings without allowing a base hit. Mariners are down in order. Still 8-0. Ready once again, Jose Peraza. It's been an 0 for 2 effort for Second him to baseman, this point. Jose Peraza. Hit on the ground out to short. Gonzalez is there. And they'll have no play as he reaches first base safely. Oh, and he overshoots his first baseman as it's over his head. Digging in once again, Stephen Norwood. 0 for 2 on his line thus far. Steven takes a look down Gilbert. at the knees for a strike. Pitch swung on and hit in the air. Nick wins under it. He's got it one away. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about trying to move up. Dan Vogelbach <laughs> is in for the third time now as he takes a called strike. It's 0-1. That pitch right there, Matt. 100% every hitter, listen to this, every hitter in the game, he's throwing a first pitch strike too. That's ridiculous. Well, I think he's trying to get that two strike fastball out of the zone. Just caught too much of the plate right there. Fortunately, he fouled it off instead of putting it in the seats. Got him. So that's the second out of the inning, and he's seven outs away now. Here's Byron Buxton now. 0 for 2 here to start the afternoon. And that one swung on and missed 0-1. I'll tell you, we're in the later stages of this ball game, but his fastball is still coming out of his hand with plenty on it. And he struck him out to retire the side, so he's through seven complete, still working. In now, Mitch Hanniger. He'll try and do what he can to work toward cutting into this big deficit. Swung on and missed, outclassed by that fastball for a strike. Swing and a miss, and he's in trouble now, 0-2. And, and the third baseman will have a look at it, but this is back into the seats. Very weakly on the ground. That's a foul ball. Going for strikeout number 15, and he struck him out for the first out of the inning, but perhaps more importantly, he's five outs away now. The Johnny Billingsley is Johnny at the plate here as he quickly Billingsley. finds himself down a strike. It's 0-1. High in the air out to center field. Naquin is there. He hauls it in without any trouble, and there are two away. 
Striding into the box, Ramon Herrera. No hits in two trips to the plate for him in the ballgame. And he just keeps rolling along as he starts another batter out with strike one. Bases are empty here with two men out. Grounder down the line at third. But this will wind up foul. Still 0-2. And he struck him out. So he's now through eight full innings and will take his no hit. Ready for another shot now. George Corona starting things for his side the in the ninth as they baseman. face the improbable George odds of Corona. trying to come back in this one. Yeah, not a lot of hope for them at this point. These guys know these bats still count, at least for their own stats. You can't mill in your chances as a professional. Right by him here, and he's set up for another strikeout here. The count to 0 and 2. Now he gets on top of one here and chops it foul right at home plate. And another one. Strikeout number 17 in the ball game as he keeps racking him up. Now batting. Cesar Hernandez comes on with one gone here as he looks at a called strike one. Some stirring now in the Cleveland bullpen. They'll get both a left-hander and a right-hander up and throwing. Struck hey. him out. 18 strikeouts for him now. It's been a rough game for him at the plate. Couldn't get the bat off his shoulder right there, and he struck out twice the before that one. Nine. So he's Second going to have a man. lot to think about okay. when he leaves the ballpark Arraza. tonight. The 0-1. And that's taken for strike two as now they're down to their final strike here this afternoon. Good job to spoil that one away and he stays alive. Ready with another two strike offering. And another foul ball. Ready with another two strike offering. Strike three called and it's over. A no hitter. Well it's something that every pitcher who's ever picked up a baseball dreams about and he's done it. A no hit gem in one of the most dominant performances I've seen in a while. He's in the record books forever now. Well obviously after a no hitter there's not a whole lot of debate as to the identity of our tops player of the game. Hey when you basically take a game into your own hands and give your opposition. A coach acknowledges a pitcher on his recent spree of strikeouts. He's on a torrid pace. They'll see if he can keep it up.